Hi, this is Ken Jennings. Hello, this is Richard Garfield. And we're taking on the Guess That Movie Based on a Board Game Challenge. Thank you so much for joining us from home. We really appreciate you doing this. Happy to be here. Been looking forward to it. So we've got a twist on our usual Guess That Movie Challenge today. Okay. Uh, these are all movies based on tabletop games. Oh! Here's how the game will work. The person at the end of the game with the most points is the winner. Okay. Okay. Cool. Oh, I'm okay. excited. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited too. Our first one is set in and around Hawaii following a classic humans versus alien plot line. Directed by Peter Berg, the film hosts a star-studded cast and a soundtrack that features the work of Tom Morello. What board games are these, bro? Mistake. Cause this board game sounds pretty fire. <laughs> I have no idea. I, I actually don't think I've seen this movie either. Okay. So I'd be very shocked. I'm going to guess. Uh, Hold on, you gotta write it down. Oh, right, 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 okay. Lilo and Stitch. Lilo and Stitch, Pacific Rim. Lilo and Stitch. That's a good one. I put Treasure Island. That makes a lot more sense than Lilo and Stitch. Battleship. Men, Men in Black. Ted, you got this one right. Oh my God. Yes. You did get it right. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Aliens are in battleship? Yeah, I don't I didn't see it, but I remember the like transformer either. looking people in it. Let me show you a screenshot. Maybe that'll help for four points. Any idea what movie this could be? I got nothing. Nothing? No. Nope. It looks like a whale. <laughs> it's not a whale. Yeah, like, like like a robotic whale. Here's the three second clip for three points. for three points, so let's see what you have. Battleships. Battleship. You both said battleship, and that is correct. Oh, it is? Wow. Any more context there? Are you I sure that's not Lilo and Stitch? <laughs> <laughs> I just thought of it. I feel dumb. Any guess? Nope. Battleship. Our next movie has developed quite a cult classic status over time, despite only making 14.5 million at the box office. The game itself is so beloved that it has been turned into both a British game show and an off-Broadway musical. While it's hard to imagine any of the characters played in any other way, both Carrie Fisher and Rowan Atkinson were originally slated to star in the film, but both of those fell through. For five points. Can you guess what that movie is? That has to be an older movie. I'm not great with older movies. Yeah, I'll move on to the screenshot. I want to say uh, a guess, but I don't want to give him an answer for a potential next round if I'm wrong. I have a guess. Okay, and Richard, do you have one as well? Sure. Emily, do you have something written down? No, I have no idea what it is. Let's see those answers. I said, too fast, too furious. Oh, of course. <laughs> I put guess. Yes. Oh. Those are both incorrect. Okay. Damn it. Yeah. Fair. Ted said clue. Emily, <gasps> no guess. <sighs> it was clue. Yeah, now I, okay. That makes so much sense. Clue and looks like clue. And you both got five points on that one. For me, it was just hearing that it was a cult movie because when I was a kid, we wore out our VHS tape of Clue. But I don't, I don't think there was any real nostalgia for that until a few years ago when people start, everybody started realizing that they also loved Clue. Here's the second round. Yep, got it. Isn't I thought this was Guess? Isn't it the one where in, they're in the manor and they have to guess who done it? Oh my God. Is that not it? No, nope. oh, that's no. Not, that's I, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> that's the movie I was thinking of <laughs> for the first time. It doesn't look like a game show to me. I know. I'm just gonna take a wild guess, and I really me too have zero context for this mystery. Clue. Clue. That's what I thought. Clue, but I don't know the name. Of I said mystery. <laughs> it's Clue. Clue. You were like, I, you even spelled. Doobie you said. <laughs> I needed a clue. Uh, the one of the only two movies based on board games that have come to mind, and for I was like, that was just a clue. Like <laughs> that one hurts because I actually loved playing Clue as a child. So this next movie is a fairly recent horror film that spawned a prequel and a novel. While it was a commercial success, the movie only has a six percent on Rotten Tomatoes. I don't watch much horror unless it's like 
interesting, like it or something. But okay. Nothing's coming to mind for me. Okay. I'm gonna write one. I don't think is right because I don't think this is a board game. I'm gonna throw him around and guess. Okay. I don't. I don't have a guess. It's not a guess. Okay. It was a good guess though. Uh, thank you. I said escape room. Oh. That's a good thought. Yeah, I have no idea. Emily, you go. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Me. Please, please, please. Oh, Ouija. <gasps> you got that correct. Oh, I should have known. <laughs> Ken, do you have a guess? I don't think so. I think Richard's writing though. Is he writing? I, I was. Uh, I have retracted my... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. Nothing. Okay, then here is the screenshot. This clears it up. Really? Uh, for sure. No. I, <laughs> oh, I was like, I have no <laughs> idea what this is. He's too dark. Who are you, guy? Bro, I'm drawing a blank over here. Yeah, same here. Can you think of any board games that might have had like a horror element to them? Candyland in our house. <laughs> <laughs> or Monopoly, if you share my views about late stage capitalism. A horror board game? I got nothing. I put 20 questions. Is it truth or dare? No. Oh, oh no guesses. On, no guesses. On to the first clip then. Yeah. This isn't Debbie. What do you mean? What do you mean? That classic <laughs> that classic screen catchphrase. What do you mean? I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna feel dumb when I see it. I don't know. I think I know what it is. Countdown? Candyland. Candy no. never took her to where? To Candyland. Is like, it really is it Candyland? I don't think so. It's I was gonna Candyland. say, I was like, that is a good guess. Holy <laughs> damn, man. Moving on. This next clip will be five seconds and it will be worth two points. This isn't Debbie. What do you mean? I never took her there. Not once. Does that add anything? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> this could be from any movie in the world. Here's the final 10 second clip. Any correct guess now will be worth one point. What do you mean? I never, I never took her there. Not once. Is this you, Debbie? Ah! Yep. That was kind of a big clue. Yeah. I guess that's kind of a game. I guess I, I, uh, I, I don't feel as stupid. Yeah, yeah. This is not a, this isn't a game. <laughs> this isn't a game. This is not a game. Spelling doesn't have to be right. Ouija board? Yeah, you each got a point. Yep, it was Luigi. The Luigi board. It's the classic. Luigi, the Mario and Luigi. It's Luigi's enough. Haunted Mansion. Yes. yes, how did we miss it? My mouse pad used to be a, a, a fake Ouija board pad, but, but the spirits never tried to do my word processing for me. <laughs> Played this a lot as a child during sleepovers. Yeah. Called up a lot of people. This next movie, which has been characterized by critics as looking cheap, is in the process of getting a remake. Despite a well-recognized cast, the original was nominated for several Stinkers Bad Movie Awards, including Worst Supporting Actor and Actress, Least Special Special Effects, and Most Unfunny Comic Relief. Wow, that's, that's a, quite, quite a, a set of credentials. How about Mousetrap? Ooh, that is a very good guess. That's not it. Oh, yeah. Oh my. Sounds like I, my I type was... of movie. What board game bombed that hard? <laughs> Shoots and ladders, so it's good. <laughs> How do you mess up a board game that hard? I think I might I might need to see a clip. I don't know. Yeah. I would love to see a clip too. I can show yeah. you a screenshot. Yeah. I'll go I'll go for a screenshot, yeah. Does not ring a bell. Does not ring a bell. This man is telling me nothing. No, uh, I don't have a guess. Uh, I was gonna guess this. Ooh. <laughs> uh. That deserves all the stinker awards. <laughs> okay, let's see those guesses. You both sound confident. Yep, you got it. Dungeons and Dragons. I don't have a guess, but- Oh, wait, I know. I know. Oh, you do. I know. Bam. What? I mean, what the f- Magic the Gathering? I'm gonna say D&D, &D, Dungeons and Dragons. Magic the Gathering? Michaela got it right. Oh, I did? Damn. Yeah, right when she said it, I knew it. This I, is done. Dungeons and Dragons. Dungeons and what? Dragons! Yes! Oh, never heard of that. Very never good. heard of that. I did not know they made a Dungeons and 
Dragon. I don't but think I they should have. <laughs> <laughs> Academy Award winner Jeremy Irons apparently wanted a beach house. Yeah. Yeah, that's impressive, Ted. I think it was the eyebrow for some reason. I was just like, it looks like a dragon. Dungeon and Dragons! Oh my gosh. For our final movie, we have an animated feature about a gingerbread boy named Jib who attempts to save his kingdom from a terrible fate. There's a board game with a gingerbread boy. Oh! Oh my gosh. Oh. I have no idea. I think this might I think I might get, get this one now. That's, that's all the details? Yep. Okay, um. Uh, it's a sweet version retelling of Monopoly. Ah! Uh, sure. <laughs> I'll guess. Candyland? And Richard, did you also say Candyland? I did. I mean, I have an answer, but I don't think my answer is correct. I'm gonna just put it out there anyways. Candyland? Is it Candyland? Candyland? You both said Candyland. You both got it right. Oh, nice. And that is correct. Oh! What? There's a Candyland movie? And I haven't seen it? There's a Candyland movie? You both got it right for five points. No way. Oh, movie? There's a Candyland movie? It went straight to DVD. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I wonder if the, the movie is as interminable as the game. <laughs> I hope Jeremy Irons plays Lord Licorice. <laughs> Ooh. With the final score of 16 to 9, Michaela, you crushed it. Mm. You know what? All I would like to mm. say is I was not the one talking in the beginning. <laughs> eh, 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 eh. Yes. Congratulations. If Richard had beaten me, he would have become the Jeopardy greatest of all time. So I just got <sighs> the bullet. This is one of the biggest wins I've had since being forced to stay in my house. So I'm really just buzzing right now. I think we tied. I don't know. Thank you, Tom. It was fun. It was really fun, Tom. That was and a good game. Lindsay. I realized how few movies are based on board games. And that's probably for good reason. This is uh, Richard Garfield. Thank you for having me. It was a lot of fun uh, seeing the best attempts we have at making games into movies. Uh, this is Ken Jennings from Jeopardy. Thanks so much for having me. And uh, I will cherish my win at board game movie trivia forever.